I'm Jay Horton. I make movies that make money. This is Two Minute Tips. If only my movie was on Netflix, everything would be real swell. If only my movie was on Netflix, I could tell the bill collectors to go to hell. If only my movie was on Netflix, the money would rain. If only my movie was on Netflix. Wait, what? Are you fucking insane? Yeah, and now you see why I never pursued poetry for a living. Point of that awful poem was, if you're chasing Netflix for your indie film, you're most likely wasting your damn time. Let me save you a lot of time and aggravation. In all likelihood, you're not getting your little independent film on Netflix. Netflix don't give a fuck about acquiring fresh independent content. They're focused on creating in-house stuff. And sure, they do pick up some, but even when they do take indie stuff, it's usually from a producer or a company with which they have a prior relationship. Now, all that said, if you make a little tiny movie and it gets in and blows up at some major film festival, sure, you got a shot. But 99.9% .9 of indies don't do that. One of the quickest ways to spot a bullshit producer in Hollywood is someone who personally has no movie on Netflix yet and talks about how they're going to make a ton of money selling something there. This is not just unlikely, it's a fucking fairy tale. But let's just say for the sake of argument, you actually do get your little movie up on Netflix. Good for you. But there's honestly not a huge financial upside there. They require an exclusive license for up to two years and they pay flat. And while I don't have concrete numbers that I can share here, I know that the amounts are not that big unless you have major name talent in the movie, a huge festival win, or production value out the ass. Oh, and the whole approved camera list thing is bullshit too. If you're shooting a movie for Netflix, like a Netflix original production financed by them, then it applies. It does not apply to content shot independently. If they do acquire your independently shot movies or series, which is very unlikely, it won't matter what the f*** you shot it on, as long as you have a 4K master. Subscribe.